Hi everyone, it's Lonnie and welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about styes and I wanted to review this product with you guys. So this is the reusable sty eye therapy warming compress. Now if you get styes, you, you, you <laughs> this video is going to be very, very helpful for you. So some of us are very prone to styes and I unfortunately am one of those people. So the one thing is, so in case you don't know what a sty is, just break it down, you get little bumps in your eyes and your eyes are swollen and it's just painful, it's uncomfortable, it it can get really bad, but it all has to do with your oil glands in your eyes. It's just, it's a whole long thing. But if you get size, you know what I'm talking about. I get them pretty frequently and I try to always keep heat on my eyes just to eliminate any of that. That's what the doctor said to do. Take a warm compress, put it on your eyes pretty much every night just to eliminate it from being an issue. So the one thing I hated about getting styes is the whole putting heat on your eyes. You would have to take a warm compress, you would have to keep reheating it, or you could take rice and put it in a um, paper towel and warming that up. And I always felt like I had to keep heating it up and I would try to heat it up really long and it was just too hot on my eyes. But then once I was able to put it on my eyes to alleviate and you know, let it do its thing. It was it instantly got cold really fast. So it was just a whole process walking back and forth to the microwave, back and forth. It's it's a pain, you know. So my best friend sent this to me, and I love this thing. I think it is so convenient. It is so handy. It works so well. I like the fact that this is all you need. This is literally all you need, well, minus the microwave. You need a microwave to warm this up. But besides that, especially if you're someone with these, you can just keep this with you, especially if you're traveling and you don't have to worry about anything but just having a microwave for this. What you wanna do with this is they give you a whole bunch of instructions and you know how to do this. I There are some tricks that I wanted to tell you about. So if you do get this and you're wondering, it says as soon as you get it, you wash this. Every time you use this, wash this. So I think that's the only thing that's, I don't even want to say it's an inconvenience. It's just for cleansiness. It's for sanitary purposes. You're putting something on your eye. You obviously want it to be clean, especially if it's infected or it hurts or, you know, it's, when I get a side, I just, I, I want everything clean and I want it to be as clean as possible. So washing this and letting it air dry, it doesn't take much. You can, if you don't want to wait overnight to let it dry or a couple of hours, you can just throw it in your dryer. What you do with this, be really careful. This is plastic. You take this and you insert it in like this and once it's in there, you kind of just, I like squeezing this part out so it's not too much of a struggle of fitting it in. So then once all the beads are in there and it's nice and snug, like so, you can just kind of mush it together and disperse all the little beads like that. So with this, you're pretty much putting this on your eye. Now, on here, it says, where is it? It says, place covered compress and microwave oven for 10 seconds on high. Now, and then underneath this says, if necessary, reheat an additional five seconds interval and test temperature again until desired temperature is reached. However, do not exceed 20 seconds total heating time per use. Don't do 20 seconds. I am telling you from experience, do not do 20 seconds. This is my second one. At the 22nd mark, it popped. And it wasn't that it was the first time. I was using it for a while and I started off with 20 seconds. So it would just hold the heat a lot longer and it swells up. So it kind, it kind of freaked me out the first few times it, where it just kind of swelled up. I was like, oh, it's gonna pop because I was really scared, but it was fine. But do not do 20 seconds. I would definitely recommend just doing 15 seconds at max because when I put 20 seconds and 20 seconds and 20 seconds, and obviously I'm not doing it just back to back. I'm giving it time to cool down. The first time for the day that I went to put it in the microwave for 20 seconds at the 22nd mark, it popped. 
it was like pop it broke it it didn't get messy but it was sad because it was I was trying to use it I needed to use it I had a spy that needed to go away and it popped so I had to order it on Amazon and it was eight dollars pretty much just depending on where you go you can get different prices I think when they first came out they were a little more expensive and now they are a little more they're a little cheaper so I think when I first saw them they were about $12 when I found them but now it's $8 on Amazon but like I said just depending where you go this works really really well though just don't exceed the 20 seconds don't do the 20 seconds sorry my opinion don't exceed 15 seconds and this holds warmth you don't have to worry about burning your eyes you don't have to worry about the heat being too much it will hold warmth it is comfortable it feels good on the eyes i i'm telling you this is so convenient so convenient if you're someone who gets sex i'm telling you it works so well so i'm really glad that my best friend put me onto this and sent this to me it it's come in so handy it's worked really really well and I, I just like it. I think it's just a really, really good, convenient little warm compress. So hopefully this video helps some of you guys out. Please let me know if you've tried this out and what you think about it, or if you have any other recommendations for, you know, a compress for styes and things like that. I know this one just says that this is meant for it, but I mean, maybe you found something else. You found a little, little hack or another another little gem that I didn't hear about but if you do share them down below I'd love to read your comments and see what you're recommending but that's it I hope this video helps you guys please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and I will see you in my next video